The darkest moment in any hero's tale usually comes just when things are finally falling into place. Our unlikely heroes have discovered the unfinished, top-secret project of the doomed Atlas Corporation. The Gortis Robot. Searching for the robot's missing components gave the former middle manager the chance to quietly reach an accord with the demented ghost of Hyperion past. And the dream of the vault seemed closer than ever. Unfortunately, any dream can quickly turn into a nightmare, and this nightmare's name was Valerie. Fortunately, Valerie's killing spree was interrupted when another dangerous adversary was suddenly revealed as a powerful ally. Now, supported by a legendary gladiator, their search continued through the icy wastes of the Borderlands to a forgotten Garden of Eden. There, they found another piece of the Gortis robot, as well as the last surviving man on the Gladiator's murder bucket list. As she prepared to take revenge, I made a foul. the con artist intervened. That was the moment that Valerie chose to strike. Outgunned and outmaneuvered, the con artist and salaryman were forced to surrender. Now, they were working for Valerie. And their first job was likely to be their last. We should find shelter. Looks like we're in for some showers. Oh, awesome. Yeah, let's let's do that. Can't wait. Are you thinking? It looks like you're you're thinking. That suit he's wearing. It looks familiar, but I I can't place it. Yeah, yeah, I hear ya. What the hell is this guy getting out of all this? I can't figure it out. This Endless march down memory lane. He wants a vault. Why else would he be collecting Gordas pieces? He's just like every idiot on Pandora looking to strike it rich. Aren't, uh, aren't you kind of, you know, vault hunting now? Are you calling me an idiot? Yeah, it's what I did there. Yeah. <sighs> I feel like we should do something. If we get to those hills, maybe we could lose him. Yes, I don't know. What's he gonna do, huh? Shoot us both? Don't be stupid. He has a gun. So? He clearly needs us for something. If he wanted to shoot us, he already would have. <laughs> I think all those shots to the head are taking their toll. That hasn't helped. I'm making a break for it. And you should too. Remember, <whistles> zigzag when you run, okay? It uh, makes you harder to hit. That sounds stupid. It's not stupid. It's, it's genius. All right. Going on three. One... Three, go! <laughs> what the hell was that? I don't know. Meteor shower. Get to the shelter. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! <laughs> What's that? Uh, this again. Clearly, I can't trust you two, so... You just gave away Gordas. She was taken. And you were stuck under Valerie's gun. It was a rocket launcher, okay? It was massive. Even for her. On? Shut up. Hey! Stop it! Please! Not so rough. Yes, ma'am.
Sorry, boss. The nerd is gone. Some old dude with crazy hair ran off with him. That's okay. We've got what's important. There, there, little one. No need to be upset. I'll answer your questions. Please, just promise that you won't hurt anyone. Of course, dear. Gordis, just... Just tell her what you know. Now, tell me about the Vault of the Traveler. The, the Vault of the Traveler teleports all over the universe, only staying in one spot for a few minutes before blinking away. But once I have my last piece, the beacon that's up on Helios, I can summon the Vault and hold it here. Then you collect treasure or something. What does the beacon look like? I... I don't know. But I'll know it when I see it. That's what happened with the last piece. Well, that's some exciting news. Thank you, Gordis. You're... you're welcome. Can I get away from you now? Of course. <sighs> Look at you, Fiona. Just so angry. <sighs> Is this about Athena? You're feeling you guilty. You hurt anyone. That's what. Leave her alone. You can't blame yourself. Athena made her own bed. Don't you want to talk about it? That's okay. Now listen up. Under normal circumstances, your rotting corpses would already be getting torn apart by skags right now. But these are not normal circumstances. And with that last piece being on Helios, I can't think of a better crew than a pair of Pandoran con artists and a Hyperion stooge to figure out a way to get it for me. What do you say? And I'll give you a hint. The only right answer is... Hell no. There's no way we're working for you. a girl. Sorry. I think I must have misheard you. Come again. Hey! What's it gonna be, Fiona? Don't give in. I I'm fine. Hey, you said you wouldn't hurt anyone. No. I said I didn't want to hurt anyone that cooperates. You heard me the first time. Hell no. It must be my age catching up with me, but I still can't hear you. Maybe if I turn up the volume. You do whatever you want! Just stop, please! That's all I wanted to hear. I'm fine. I'm fine. It's good you didn't give in. She'll respect us now. What the hell is wrong with you two? We've got principles. Son. Yeah? Be a dear and help them come up with a plan. Yes, ma'am. Let's get cracking. <laughs>